Hello everyone and welcome to Farming Simulator 2017 and today we're going to be looking at a mod. It is the Wilson Livestock Trailer version 1. It's uh, based off a Wilson trailer, it's Silver Star, with a bullnose front and quite an antiquated uh, front tire uh, deal. Uh, you hardly see that anymore. Um, it is the bullnose so it does have the placard for the top uh, where you normally see the company name and you know, it looks pretty good, but there are a few issues with it. And, you know, that's why you make these videos, is to see things. Um, the texturing under here just isn't that well made. It actually looks like it was converted from 15, whenever they kind of do it like that. Uh, that should be the same aluminum as the rest, or it can be a black steel, which is uh, powder coated and has a slight texture. These are actually made in a town called Yankton, South Dakota, and I actually live about 45 minutes of there so uh, the toolbox is everything right the wheels and uh, tires they look good but they're missing holes and they most normally are aluminum uh, if they go for a steel wheel it's normally like a uh, bud white wheel uh, with either two or four hole the back looks good uh, there's no animations to this and that's kinda like the big downfall I really like it it's fun to use and everything but the um, Having like the gate come down, there's like a chute that rolls out of here, and that can get you to the upper and lower level, which I can show you actually here in just a minute. Uh, yeah, from the outside looks really good. Uh, of course, you have to make some, uh, what do you call it? Like you can't make perfect ovals and circles all the time in Blender for Farming Simulator. Uh, performance is based off of tries and vertices so having too many perfect or not perfect but you know pretty well rounded things can actually uh, cause a lot of performance issues so you know we've got like some artifacting in the texture right here uh, it doesn't look like it was UV mapped too well but uh, yeah overall I mean it's a good 20 footer you stand this far away and it looks really really good and you're not gonna be up here like show me the toolbox and this is another issue I found uh, the collision seems to be kinda messed up so you can get in and there is supposed to be an upper and lower deck so that that uh, piece there is uh, right but there's normally gates and everything in here see it, it works here it's just right there you can kinda go through so that needs a little bit of work um, but yeah let's uh load it up and take it for a quick little jaunt we'll buy some animals all right uh how many cows can hold twenty eight that's not bad so, yeah, we'll buy 28 cows. Sure. And the lights and everything work. You can actually see them all in here, so that's that's pretty good. Some cow butt. There's some cow butt. And all of the chicken lights work. So all like the they <laughs> they call them chicken lights, but they're marker lights on the side. Uh, a lot of the like this is normally called a bull rack. They um, put a lot more lights than what's this down the side of it, and it looks like Christmas lights all the time. And apparently started with chicken trailers, so everybody calls them chicken lights. It does drop pretty good. It pulls nice. There's a lot of flexibility in the pin, so that's actually really nice. Now, I'm not sure if that is truck side or trailer side. So, I think it's more truck side than trailer side, but it's still nice to have a little bit of flexibility with what you're doing. Yeah, it uh, pulls nice. It looks really good. And besides those couple of issues, I have no problem with it at all. It's actually uh, in use on one of my farms right now. Not this, not this file. This is my Let's Goof Around file. I don't think that it gets dirty though. That would be my only uh, 
not the only thing that would make me mad now. Mine on my save game normally only sees the road, so I've never seen it dirty. I can check the XML file, but you know, sometimes you know it's fine. If something doesn't get dirty, it's okay. I just like all my stuff to be dirty. Blinkers work. I'm on the wrong side of the road. There's the left. There's the right. Left again. All that works. Yeah, so it's not, uh, it's pretty good. I like it. Uh, maybe in version 1.1, 1 .1, uh, the collision can be fixed. Uh, a couple of decals, uh, like your cattle drive right there. The decal does not look like that. Uh, you've seen a couple of those. I don't believe that they're factory on the trailers. I think that's something that they put on. And most of the time your Wilson uh, logo has a little bit of sheen to it. The mud flaps are correct for the time period the truck was built. The 125th anniversary was not that long ago. I can never remember which road this is. I guess this one. It's not a little bit of a drop through some grass. It doesn't matter. Looks like we're going to drop through some grass. So we know it offloads, we know it onloads, my blinker is still on, I'm trying not to take out light poles. I'm using a wheel, I just got my wheel, so cut me some slack, I'm still trying to learn it. Anywhere here? No. <laughs> it's at the door. Duh. I haven't played Goldcrest in a long time. Am I not in the trigger? this all up. There we go. I'll load all of our cows here. Hey, we have cows. But yeah, that's it. Your Wilson uh, bull rack. You know, nothing special. Silver Star. Like I say, pretty good mod. I like it. I use it. So, give it a download. Try to like it. I guess I'll see you guys in the next one.